panic and chaos as crowds flee and gunshots ring out in the Tunisian resort island of Djerba. Authorities say an officer of the naval guard shot a security guard before opening fire outside the Griba synagogue. The gunman killed and wounded several visitors and police officers before he was shot dead. The attack happened during a Jewish pilgrimage at Griba, one of Africa's oldest synagogues. Thousands of pilgrims travel to the holy site every year. Many come from Europe, the United States and Israel to take part in an event held between Passover and Shavuot. Although it's predominantly Muslim, Tunisia is home to one of North Africa's largest Jewish communities. The Griba synagogue has been targeted before in an Al-Qaeda suicide bombing in 2002. 21 people were killed. And in 2015, twin attacks in Tunis and Suez killed dozens of tourists. This attack is happening uh, at the beginning of the touristic se season uh, of the summer. And the Tunisian authorities rely a lot on the revenues of tourism uh, to face the growing economic and financial problems. They don't want to have any impact on the tourist, uh, touristic uh, season. France and the United States have condemned the latest shooting. While investigators try to determine the motive for the attack, Tunisian authorities are calling it an act of cowardly aggression. Rahila Mohamed, Al Jazeera.